Hi, my name is Steve Small with Gem Fair. Today we're with the Niton DXL. It's a metal testing machine. It tests the composition. It's an x-ray, so it breaks down all the different elements in each one of the metals. It'll tell you how much gold, copper, etc., that are in each piece of your jewelry. We do complimentary testing for any of the exhibitors that have their sales in progress. If they want a reconfirmation or the customer has a little apprehensiveness about buying a ring, whether it's 18 karat gold, 2014. They can always bring it back here to Gem Fair, have it tested for free. We also have the ability that we can do a printout with um, the machine here on a USB so that the customer does have a hard copy for their insurance company if they require that. Not too many years ago, before the Niton DXL came on the market, we used to have to take a knife or screwdriver, some type of a sharp object, scratch across the surface, which would mark the jewelry, devalue it, and then you would put your acid on there. It would turn a different color. You could test gold, silver. Different acids would test for different carats of gold. Whereas the Niton tells you exactly what you have here, the quality of metal broken down. And today we have several pieces of not jewelry. I can get some jewelry pieces over here real quick, but we do have some gold coins here that we'll test real quick and show you. I do have one piece of jewelry, I'll take that back. This was sold to a customer as 18 karat gold. And as you will find out on the video, it's not purported to be 18 karat gold. This is something entirely different. And we'll have the video show you on the screen that it is not 18 karat gold. This is a 1 tenth ounce gold eagle, fine gold. They're minted by the United States government. They're sold, a lot of people use them for jewelry, earrings, necklaces. They put them on rings as such. And a lot of people just buy them as an investment. Getting away from the fiat currency, not to bring that into it, but it's a good insurance policy against inflation. Put that right in here. This is the little x-ray eye right in here. And what it does, it x-rays, it'll break it down exactly what the metal content is. These are sold as fine gold. And you will see it's not 24 karat gold because the government puts in a little bit of copper, which you can see here. You've got 90% gold there. You've got 6% copper. 3% silver. This is a complete breakdown. Next up, we have a piece of jewelry here that a customer brought in, and they bought this as 14, 18 karat gold, excuse me. It was an 18 karat gold piece, and I don't know how to open this, but I don't want to break it. But she bought this. It was sold to her as an 18 karat gold. So, and it is stamped in there. I don't know if you can pick that up on the video, but it's stamped in there, 18 karat gold. We're going to put it in the machine here. We're going to find out, just like we did the coin, what the purity of that 18 karat gold is. And you see it is not gold. You've got 61% copper, 27% zinc, nickel here 10%, 7.7 silver plate, and you'll see up here the 0.18 that shows it's gold plated. It's fake. Even though it's stamped 18 karat gold, it is not. So whenever buying jewelry, I'm not gonna say jewelry store, trade show, wherever, always check. Don't take the salesperson's word for it. Anybody can go down and buy a $20 stamp, put 18 karat gold on it, sell it to you as 18 karat gold. When you're shopping at Gem Fair, you can rest assured 100% of the jewelry that you buy at Gem Fair is what it is purported to be. You can double check it right here anytime free. You can bring some of your own jewelry in if you have any questions about it. And if time permits, we do complimentary gold testing on your heirloom jewelry that you might have at home. So beautiful piece, but not 18 karat gold.